What are we going for today, Stu? Road night. Traipsing through the bushes. Hard rock mining for road night. Through our secret tunnel. Oh my god, bear. Just kidding, that's Gemma. Alright. You can see the oxidization on the rocks through here. That black metallic shine. And some pink in there. That's a lower grade piece, but here has some of that yellow road night in this piece here. So we're gonna go work the uh there's quartz and stuff in there too. We're gonna go work the hammer chisel and uh show you what we find, but we're literally traipsing through the rainforest here. Ready for it? Check this out. Go this way. I'm already down. Alright. Check it out. We'll go down there later. There's a cave. But all this, that's all road night. Let's take a look in close here. See the pink? It's all oxidized. See how the surface of the rock has turned black there? And then anywhere we're chipping in, we'll see pink, like here. I just busted a piece off. See that meaty flesh color? That's the pink rodenite. Here's some chips I think I've made from previous times here. So, it's wild and I've always told this to people. You could be hiking around in the woods, not even realize it because it just looks like regular old rock, but you're literally standing in front of a, a pink mountain face because everything underneath these oxides is just vibrant pink rock. Isn't that cool? And then we got the cave down here. Should we go in? There's little railroad tracks. Little mine shaft, yeah, and there's some uh, calcite stalactites forming on the ceiling of it, which is pretty wild. Let me just do a 360 here. Hopefully there's not a bear in there. Yeah. The first time I found this, because uh, you didn't even know it was here, eh? Yeah, I was just wandering around the site and I found this and I was pretty sketched to go in there. So, let's see. Let's hope there's nothing in there again. Because <laughs> it does not look inviting, let's put it that way. Should I throw a rock in? I think we're okay. Let's wander on in. Oh. Let me turn the flashlight on here. Nope. No flashlight in my settings. We're going in dark, folks. Going in dark. Into a cave in the middle of the woods. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Oh. Well, if you're in here, just don't eat me. That's all I ask. Just don't eat me. Just don't eat me. It's getting dark. The sun's getting real low. <laughs> it's scary. I can't even see. As black as it is, my fingers are in front of the screen. As scary as it is for you, it's that scary for me too. Okay, I'm with you. Let me take a flash photo. I'll take a photo in here for you. But... Let me see, maybe, see these cal calcite stalactites right here in the entrance, starting to grow off the ceiling there. There's some more. There's the entrance there. All right, we're back at it. Shh, be very, very quiet. Oh no! Ah! Yeah, so you got two options. 
you can hammer for the good stuff or uh, pick through the scraps here, knocking them apart, knocking windows in so you can see whether it's a piece worth taking or not. I'll run the uh, hammer chisel today to show you guys that. There we go. I'm gonna show you this one. This will be good. There's yellow in it. Yellow on the other side. Not as much pink. So not as good as I wanted. But. This is a really good piece. There we go. That'll be awesome. Let's look at this one. There we go. There's the nice yellows and pinks. Beauty. Nice solid chunk too. That'll make good caps. But it's all running down the hillside there. And uh, I'll come down here and I'll show you this ore cart down there. Let's do a fast paced video. Ready, go. Oh, look at that thing. That's metal. Don't trip over that. Oh, maybe it's the other one over there that I gotta, gotta go to. All right, let's go. Well, I don't know where it is. Last time I was wandering around here, there was an old conveyor belt, not an ore chute, sorry. An old conveyor belt that they were sending material down the cliff from. Anyway, let's hike yonder back up. So, you'll notice all throughout the ledge here, these black rocks. See all this? All the road and night a rock hound could ever dream for. Here's the landing where we eat our lunch. And uh, another spot with a bunch of rocks up in there. Big waste pile or something. I've hiked before all the way up and I've chiseled at rocks up there, but I never found anything worthwhile. So we'll head back to uh, our secret spot in the trees. This is what cuts beautifully. When, uh, when you get nice solid yellow quartz with the pink streaks when you cut that clean. It looks like uh, yellow and pink lasers going through it. So, we got some good solid pieces. My pile going on here. See that? Nice, nice, good solid chunks. Uh, but again, vibrant pinks. Let me lick this. Beautiful pinks and yellows. Got the manganese on the surface. So this is what I've been chiseling out of uh, up there. Right there in the wall. Lots and lots of pieces set aside that I gotta haul out of here now and it's quite the hike out. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh yeah, look at that. Wait, wait, let me focus. Oh yeah, nice yellows and pinks. Yeah, beauty.
I done good. You actually got some pink stuff too, just out from down at that pile too, didn't you? Yeah, I was going for the quartzy stuff with the yellow. When, when, I mean, when you went down below there? Oh yeah. Like, pictures and some of this.